In this video, we will learn how to make a washing powder, high quality detergent powder. So let's start. For this, we require all these 10 ingredients to make. And most importantly, main ingredients are acid slurry and washing soda or soda ash. The quantity mentioned here is basically for making 5 kg detergent powder. So let me introduce all the ingredients. First of all is SLS liquid or SLS liquid. It's basically a cleansing agent and used in personal care products like toothpaste, shampoos and shaving creams. Second product is acid slurry. We all know it is mainly used in making liquid soaps and washing soda for making washing detergent. And the fourth product is TSP which is trisodium phosphate. It is basically a cleaning agent and a stain remover for your detergent. And the next is STPP sodium tripolyphosphate which is mainly used in detergents and soaps. Now next come G salt. It is basically salt of G acid and dipotassium salt. And the next comes here CMC which is carboxymethyl cellulose. It is a thickening and emulsifying agent for oils. And the next comes is Tinopol. This is basically a fluorescent and whitening agent and basically a brightener for your detergent. And your colored granules which is used to fill color in your washing powder. And last the red rose or any fragrance which you want to add into your detergent powder. So all these 10 ingredients will help you in making a high quality detergent powder. So let's start the process. So before starting the manufacturing I would like you to wear hand gloves for your hand safety and this nose mask for keeping you away from nose irritation. So let's start the process. So firstly we will add our washing soda or soda ash powder around 2.5 kg into our empty bucket. In this way we will add 2.5 kg washing soda to our bucket for making 5 kg of detergent powder. Now the second step is we will add acid slurry around 500 grams to this washing soda. In this way we will add acid slurry. Now we have added two major ingredients which are used for making detergent powder and we will mix it well. Acid slurry and our washing soda. We can use our hand also and this stick also. Now the third step is we will add SLS liquid around 200 ml to this mixture. This is sodium laurel sulfate. This is basically used in all personal care products like shampoo, shaving cream and we will again mix this mixture. So till now we have added three things washing soda, acid slurry and SLS liquid and we will mix it well. Now the fourth step is we will add TSP around 500 grams to this mixture. TSP is basically trisodium phosphate we will add to this mixture. It is basically a cleaning agent and a stain remover and again we will mix it well. Now the fifth step is we will add STPP around 500 grams to this mixture. STPP is basically sodium tripolyphosphate which only used in detergent and soap. Now again we will mix it well. So till now we have added five things into this mixture. We can use our both hands to mix it also. And with both our hands we can crush this mixture. Now the sixth step is we will add CMC powder around 100 grams to this mixture. CMC powder is basically carboxymethyl cellulose which is basically thickening and emulsifying agent and we will mix it well. So till now we have added six things 
Now the seventh step is we will add tinopol to this mixture around 100 grams. This is basically a fluorescent whitening agent which basically provides brightness for your detergent. So if we require brightness for our detergent we will have to add tinopol to this mixture and we will mix it well. We can feel here the hotness of the mixture. It is quite hot because manufacturing is going on of the detergent. So wearing hand gloves is necessary. Now the eighth step is we will add G salt. This is basically salt of G acid. We will add around 1 kg to this mixture. G salt is basically dipotassium salt. This is our eighth step and eighth ingredient. For mixing it well, we will use both our hands. So whenever we have to mix our ingredients, we have to mix our ingredients just like this with both of our hands. So in a way, we can say our detergent is ready because only two things are left now. One is colored granules and the other is fragrance. So our ninth step is to add fragrance to it. We are adding red rose fragrance to this mixture. Around 50 ml we will add and we, again we will mix it well. So our final step is to add color granules to our mixture. These colored granules will provide color to our detergent and a nice appearance to it. So after adding colored granules, our detergent will look like this. Really a great quality. This is a high quality detergent powder which is looking like exactly and which will work exactly like Surf Excel Ariel and much better than these Surf powders and it is quite cheap also. This is our handmade surf powder. We can make this detergent powder in just $5. In just $5 it will cost for making 5 kg of detergent powder. We can make this at home and we can also do the business of it and gain a big profit by doing the business of detergent powder. So this is the complete procedure of making high quality detergent powder. I hope you like my video and please subscribe my channel for more such videos. Thank you.